Hey everyone, welcome back to Pop Culturally Challenged. My name is David. This is my beautiful wife, Tony. Hello. And tonight we're doing a, something different. We're doing Tony's Choice. This is uh, your pick of the month. You want to tell us about it? I don't know anything about it. <laughs> you picked I, it. <laughs> I think it's the proposal and it looked like a happy movie, so... <laughs> <laughs> I actually don't even remember the trailer at this point. But. Okay. Well, this one was with Sandra Bullock and um, Ryan Reynolds. I think where they, it looked from the trailer like she's his boss. and Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So one. this one looked like fun. And so yeah. she needs a, a passport or something. Yeah. A green card. And she has to marry to be able to obtain that. Yep. 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 That's what it looked I like. Rem so. I remember that now. Okay. So you're really looking forward to this one. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, well, I haven't seen it either, so this should be fun. It'll give you a break from the typical war, you know, sad comedy. Well, I mean, we do a lot of different ones on the channel, so, but it'll, you get a choice, so. Thank you for giving me a choice. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You ready to get started? Yes. All right. Well, if you guys enjoy this reaction, please give us a thumbs up, comment down below, let us know what you thought of the proposal and what else tony should add to her list for tony's choice i already have like the whole year planned <coughs> out okay all right well i mean you can never have you can you can never have too many options right i guess maybe so, i'll like some suggestions more than what i yeah. already have on the list yeah see then i get too many choices and then i can't make up my mind and well if, if it comes down to that we'll just use some random generator to pick it how's that oh that sounds great sound good yes all right. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, share. Turn on the notification <laughs> bell. <laughs> Getting you tonight, aren't I? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I didn't know I was going to have to think so hard today. <laughs> All right. And on that note, on with the show. So I don't know how old this movie is. I really don't know much about it. Oh, it's on TV. I was like, that's weird. Must be one of those Pelotons that you... Oh, maybe not. No, she's just got a big TV in front of her. Uh-oh, his clock's lashing. I wonder how many women actually poke their face like that. I don't know of anyone. No, I don't know. Regular lattes. Literally saved my life. Thank you. Thank you. You got lucky. Yeah. He seems a little stressed out. Yeah. They didn't put that little... Oh, they're empty cups, it looks like. <laughs> no, he had liquid coming out of it. Did he? People in this country are busy, broke, and they hate to read, and they need someone they can trust to say, hey, don't watch... TV. Maybe I should have dressed up like that. Though I couldn't wear those heels very long. <laughs> well, it's not like you'd be walking, so... That's true. Wait, cut it. Let's let me go change. Oh, oh wait! Oh, oh, Jesus! Frank, can I tell you what I'm else they have? I'm surprised your hair's not perfect. Fill it, sir. Leave the shirt off your back, literally. Yankees, Boston, this Tuesday, two company seats for your shirt. You have five seconds to decide. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> so everybody, it's here. <laughs> this almost feels like the devil wears Prada. Yeah. He even got his tie. Her immigration lawyer called and said that it's imperative. You cancel the call, push the meeting to tomorrow, and keep the lawyer on the sheet. Get a hold of PR and have them start drafting a press release. Frank is doing Oprah. Nicely done. If I want your praise, I will ask for it. Wow, she seems nice. Actually, we're headed to your office right now. <laughs> Doesn't she get this message? It seems like it's on there. Bob, I'm letting you go. Now, I will give you two months to find another job, and then you can tell everyone you resigned. Wow. You poisonous bitch! You can't fire me! Stop, stop. It's just because you have no semblance of a life. You think that you can treat all of us like your own personal slaves. Because you know what you're going to have on your deathbed? <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Miss Tate. Now she's just rude. Yeah. Your visa application has been denied. That, that... And you are being deported. Deported? And apparently there was also some paperwork that you didn't fill out in time. Come on, it's, it's not like I'm even an immigrant. 
I'm from Canada, for Christ's sake. Yeah, but unfortunately, you have to leave the country for at least a year. Work from home? <laughs> I really like her little outfit. If you're deported, you can't work for an American company. There is no way I am, I am begging I, you. No, Marty, there, excuse it, me, I we're in a meeting. What? Mary from Ms. Winfrey's office called. She's on the line. I know. She's on hold. She needs to speak to me right away. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's something that you should know. We're, uh, we're getting married. Who, who is getting married? You and I. You and I are getting married. <laughs> you're fired for dating an employee. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time one of us <laughs> fell for our secretaries, would it, Edwin? <laughs> mm -hmm. We are uh, just two people who weren't meant to fall in love, but we did. We no. Did. No. <laughs> can't fight a can't fight a love like ours. <laughs> just make it legal. Hmm? Oh, we need to get ourselves to the immigration office so we can work this little mess out. Gentlemen, thank you, gentlemen. <laughs> wow, that cut out fast. Real. <laughs> <laughs> he looks thrilled, doesn't he? I don't understand what's happening. They were going to make Bob chief. So naturally, I would have to marry you. <laughs> I'm not going to marry you. Sure, you are. Because if you don't marry me, your dreams of touching the lives of millions with the written word are dead. Maybe I can work for the other guy. <laughs> Bob is going to fire you the second I'm gone. That means all the time that we spent together, all the lattes were all for nothing, and all your dreams of being an editor are gone. Don't worry, after the required allotment of time, we'll get a quickie divorce and be done with me. I think I'd take my chances <laughs> out on the job market. <laughs> I'm uh, Mr. Gilbertson. Ah! And you must be Andrew, and you must be Margaret. Margaret. Is that a Prada bag? Probably. Are you both committing fraud to avoid her deportation so she can keep her position as editor-in-chief at Colden Books? We know you're incredibly busy with a, a room full of gardeners and delivery boys to tend to. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Step one will be a scheduled interview, and I'll ask you every little question that a real couple would know about each other. Step two, if your answers don't match up at every point, you will be deported and you, young man, will have committed a felony. So, Andrew, you wanna, you wanna talk to me? No? Mm. <laughs> the truth is, Margaret and I are just two people who weren't supposed to fall in love. The funny thing is, they probably know a lot about each other. Have the two of you told your parents about your secret love? Impossible. My parents are dead. <laughs> what? Are your parents dead? Oh, no. His are, his no. are very much alive. You're going to tell them this weekend. Gammy's 90th birthday, and the whole family's coming together. <laughs> and where is this surprise going to take place? Huh? Sitka. Sitka. Alaska. Alaska. <laughs> I'm sorry, were you not in that room? I'm looking at a $250,000 fine and five years in jail. That changes things. Promote you to editor? No. Then I quit and you're screwed. Bye bye, Margaret. Andrew. It really has been a little slice what? of Andrew, happy. Andrew, fine. Hmm. I'll make you editor, fine. I think that is a Prada. Ask me nicely to marry you, Margaret. What does that mean? What? You heard me, on your knee. <gasps> <laughs> Right in front of the office? Yeah. <laughs> Fine. Really expensive shoes. Mm. Uh, does, does this work for you? Oh, this I like good? this, yeah. Okay, <laughs> Say it like you mean it. Andrew? Yes, Margaret. Would you please put the cherries on top, marry me? Okay, I don't appreciate the sarcasm, but I'll do it. Good. See you at the airport tomorrow. <gasps> he should have made her say that she will love him for the rest of her life. There you go. <laughs> you have four days to learn all this about me, so. You know all the answers to these questions about me. Scary, isn't it? Mm, what am I allergic to? Pine nuts, full spectrum of human emotion. Oh, that's so. <laughs> Do I have any scars? I'm pretty sure that you have a tattoo. Two years ago, your dermatologist called and asked about a Q-switch laser, but you canceled your appointment. 
<laughs> we are beginning our descent into Juno. Juno, I thought we were going to Sitka. We are. Well, how are we getting to Sitka? <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right. Oh, oh it's so good to You're see you. You're suffocating in oh. grace. Come here. Oh. Margaret's my mom. Oh, hello. Uh, yeah. Now, do you prefer being called Margaret or Satan's mistress? <laughs> 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 We're thrilled to have you. Come on, let's get you to back to the fort. Okay. The fort? <laughs> wow, that's beautiful. Will you yeah. take me to Alaska, honey? Sure. Would you take me to Sitka? We I wouldn't mind. We, we can... wouldn't mind a small little plane like that. Yeah, uh, I, well, I, I don't want to go on a small plane like that. Last name is Paxton. Ah, please don't do that. You didn't tell me about all the family businesses, honey. You're probably just being modest, dear. Oh. <laughs> you want to use your legs to lift that one? Andrew. Look, look at that Louie. Oh my gosh, look at that Louie. <laughs> Did you see the shoes that Rob was wearing? <laughs> <laughs> Where are they this going? Is the last of them. <laughs> Oh, 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 it's a Louie. <laughs> I'm not getting on that boat. You don't have to. See you in a few days. No, I can't swim. Hence the boat. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like it's cold and that coat doesn't look like it would be very... Take your time, no. Shh. <laughs> Take your time. <laughs> so a little hand here. What? Hand off ass. <laughs> Trying to be helpful. <laughs> oh, gosh, look at that. Wow. Michael, so nice to meet you, Margaret. Welcome to Sitka. People need to think that we are in love. So let's just. That, hey, that's no problem. I can do that. I can Good. pretend to be the, the doting fiance. That for you, it's, it's going to require that you stop snacking on children while they dream. <laughs> Never figured you for a guy who slept his way to the middle. I don't know. She's not my meal ticket, Dad. She's my fiance. Apparently, nobody had told him that. Well, no. They, that's what they were just arguing about when they're gonna say. I know. I'm not a I'm fish person. I like it. Uh, <laughs> You're very, it, very sweet. I yeah, think I if you. Want. <gasps> God, who does that? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I have a very important announcement to make. <laughs> Margaret and I are getting married. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, hey, where are you at? Uh, uh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> no right ring there, on. ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. There she is. Thank you very much. Oh, I guess the mom didn't know anything about it either. No, nobody did. Andrew, hi. Oh, no. Gert. Oh, my God. Hey, hi. Wow. Well, um, congratulations, you guys. Thank you. So, did I miss the story? What's what the story? story? About how you propose. Oh, how a man proposes says a lot about his character. <laughs> Actually, Margaret loves <laughs> telling the story, so I'm just going to let her go. <laughs> she is an editor, so I'm sure yeah. she can make something up. Yeah, you've read enough of these, right? Okay, well, um, Andrew and I were about to celebrate our first anniversary. I knew that he'd been itching to ask me to marry him and he was scared like a little tiny bird. <laughs> yeah, that's not exactly how it happened. No? No. Hmm. Yeah, this woman's about as subtle as a gun. <laughs> <laughs> I opened that beautiful little decoupage and out fluttered these tiny little hand cut heart. I looked down and I saw the most beautiful, big, fat, nothing. No ring. No ring. But inside that box, underneath all that crap, <laughs> naturally, Margaret. She I thought, thought he was that... seeing someone else. I went to that hotel anyway. I went there and I pounded on the door. There he was, standing, kneeling, like a man, on a bed of rose petals, choking back soft, soft sobs. <laughs> <laughs> Margaret, will you marry me? And she said, "Yep." In the end, I was hungry. 
quite a story. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, Andy, you are so sensitive. Hey, let's see a kiss oh, yeah. from you two cuties. Yeah, yeah. Give her a kiss. Now, kiss her on the mouth like you mean it. Nobody ever did that. I've never seen anybody do this. <laughs> a real one. It's like a Hallmark kiss. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are. Wow, this is um, beautiful. So uh, where is um, Andrew's room? <laughs> oh my God, what is, what is it? Oh, whoa, whoa. what is it? Kevin, I'm sorry, so Margaret. Cute. Just be sure you don't let him outside or the eagles will snatch him. <laughs> Use this. I call it the baby maker. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so good night, everybody. Good night. It's like middle of the day. <laughs> or does it stay light all the time up there? The door's open. Um, oh, it's to the bathroom. Are, you, are your eyes closed? Completely. Are Those are the pajamas you decided to bring to Alaska. I was supposed to be in a hotel alone, remember? Can we just go to sleep? <laughs> what is she doing? Can't get out of the light. <laughs> Thank you. I don't think I could function <laughs> like that. What is wrong with her? Where is it? Oh. Purse, side pocket. Frank, darling, it's going to be fine. I can just call them and I can cancel. Oh no. Oh no. Is he going to get picked up by an eagle? <laughs> oh, no, no, not so you, Frank. Cute. No, no. Shh, dog, I'm on the phone. Uh, Frank, I just, uh, I just, uh, I, I just want you to be happy. Frank, give me that dog. Oh no. Just a second, give me that dog. <gasps> she lost the phone. Okay, gotcha. I don't want to sell you on anything, but this is your legacy. Again. My phone is on all the time. Okay, bye-bye. No, wait. Oh. No, no. Take the doggy. Take the doggy. <laughs> I need that phone. Take the dog. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Oh, my God. Eagle came and tried to take the dog, and then I saved him, and then he came back and took my phone. Relax, all right? We'll, we'll order another phone, same number. We'll go into town tomorrow, and we'll get it. Really? Okay? Yeah. You have to get ready. What? Oh, you're going out with mom and the girls. You're going. I'm not going. Yes, you are. I'm not going. Now, give me a nice big hug. We don't no, want to think we're fighting. Yeah. That's nice. There we go. <laughs> if you touch my ass one more time, I will cut your balls off in your sleep. All right, Ida. So, uh, we clear on that? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He must lose a lot of balls. Yeah. I owe you an apology. Accepted. I've been going over my retirement plans recently. It doesn't mean anything. Unless, Unless you have someone to leave it to. Yeah, we've already discussed this. Yeah, guy. I'd like to discuss it again. I think I've been more than understanding about your goofing off in New York. No, no, Here we go home. again. When are you going to start taking what I do seriously? I wish you had another son. I really do. It must seem strange to you, my life in New York, sitting in an office, reading books. But it makes me happy. Understand? Girl, if that's what makes you happy, son, I got nothing to say. Apology not accepted. I thought the father was being genuine. Yeah, but he, then he, like, totally, you know, like, calls him out on everything he's doing. You're goofing off. You're sure. wasting time. You know. Big surprise, because this is one of Sika's greatest treasures. <laughs> oh, Mark, you're going to love it. A male stripper? On an island? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. The only exotic dancer on the island. We don't need to see this, do we? <laughs> oh, 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 oh
Just threw away perfectly good shrimp. Oh no. Andrew, honey, is everything okay? Why is Andrew out there hollowing out that old stupid canoe again? Well, maybe he's planning to escape. What did you do? I just had a, a frank conversation with him about his future. Now, he is my son. I only get to see him every three years because of you. You are going to be supportive of him marrying Margaret, and that is that. that. And God forbid that they should have a grandchild that we never get to see. <laughs> you crying? You chose this movie, not me. <laughs> towel. This is all they have for a towel. There are the towels. Hello? <laughs> let me just, let me just get a towel. Let me just get a towel. Just, oh no, she's gonna fall in. <laughs> oh no, you can see where this is going. <laughs> it looks like she still huh? has makeup on. You like that? Huh. You like it. Why oh my go gosh! Out there? <laughs> You're outside! No, it's Alaska. He's on his own private little island, so... Come on! Oh! oh. <gasps> oh. 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 <laughs> 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 Your tattoo's on the... <laughs> yeah. How did he see that? You know, she turned around. So. Can we, uh, not talk about that, please? What's the deal with you and your father? Oh, I'm sorry. That question is not in the binder. I like the psychic network. Not in the ha-ha, isn't that funny? She likes that trash kind of way. I actually quite enjoy it. I took disco lessons in the sixth grade. Don't like flowers in the house because they remind me of funerals. Haven't slept with a man in over a year and a half in the uh, bird tattoo <clears throat> they're swallows got them when i was 16 after my parents died you really haven't slept with anyone in 18 months oh my god out of all that that's all you got <laughs> <laughs> don't take this the wrong way that's not gonna be good <laughs> you are a very very beautiful that was a sweet moment. Mm hmm How is his back not killing him? <laughs> what is she worried about? She looks so pretty. So sad. My hair comes up like... <laughs> <laughs> come up with a proposition we want you to get married uh, here tomorrow no. oh we're, no no it's 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 gammy's big birthday tomorrow night i've had 89 birthday parties i don't need another one 
would be a dream come true for me to see my one grandchild's wit. <laughs> He's on their head. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay, we will do everything. And you and you can get married like we did in the barn. Oh wow. Yep. <laughs> I've always wanted to get married in a in a barn. I have. It's a sign. Oh my god. How are they gonna pull that off? Just old Okay, this is a little rough. Oh no. Thought I hate it. Why can't you stop it? Oh, stop, 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 stop! I just wanted some air. Uh oh. A bear. <laughs> it's a bear or something or a moose. Sounds like drums, though. Is it your grandmother? I think so. Dance with me in celebration. You know, can I can I just uh, thank her from here? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. She wanted some exercise, right? Yeah. Use your vowels. E O G yes. to the universe. The universe. Ah, ah. The universe. Wow. The sweat dripped down my balls. What? The sweat dripped down my balls. So all you bitches crawl. All you see the window. The sweat dripped down my balls. Oh, get your phone out. I don't know what year this was. I'll start recording if you can. Let me see you get low. You scared. You scared. Drop your ass to the floor. You scared. You scared. Let me see you get low. You scared. Woo! Yeah. Digging me. Digging me. What you doing? Digging me. <laughs> I would have had my camera out. Like, what are you doing? You know, Balls. That's what came to your heart. <laughs> you know it. Uh, You're a freak. Shut up. <laughs> now she can get in the boat quite easily. You know, there's a phone waiting for her. Andrew, hey. He's wow, everywhere. I phone I ordered. Yes, it came in. Hola. Hola. <laughs> Remember this? Relax. Yes. Do it. Yes. Wonderful. Do you want to go Wonderful. Do it? She backs up. <laughs> Here we go. It's all charged up, Andrew. And I put your lady's number in too. My lady. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. I need a computer. Is there is there a computer in this godforsaken town? Okay, so when it runs out, it gives you a warning. Just put in more dimes. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is old. <clears throat> oh, she's gonna get jealous. Well, she's kind of messing up his happiness, though. Yeah. Can't believe this is happening. <laughs> yeah, and don't worry about the fit because Annie is the best tailor in Southeast Alaska. <laughs> wow, incredible. Oh, let's see if we can find your boobs. <laughs> Now, just one special touch and you're ready. Been in the family for more than 150 years. My great-grandfather gave it to my great-grandmother. She was a lot like you. Wouldn't take no for an answer. I want you to have it. Take it. Uh, are you? Mm. Are you all right, dear? Uh, well, I, um... She doesn't know how to swim. Oh shit. I mean, she's not sinking. 
And she's fully clothed, so <laughs> you would think she would drop down. Jimmy, come on, give me your hand. What the hell are you thinking? You could have got yourself killed. Uh -huh. You turned the boat and made me fall in your jackass. Right, come here, you gotta get warm. Come on. Come on. She would be freezing. I want to talk to both of you. This can't be good. Yeah. Told you I'd check up on you. Oh, shit. What did you do? Luckily for you, your father negotiated a deal on your behalf. You're going to make a statement admitting this marriage is a sham, or you're going to go to prison. Take the deal. I've been working for Margaret Tate for three years. Six months ago, we started dating. We fell in love. I asked her to marry me. She said yes. Yeah, this is going a little little far now. I mean, <laughs> you're going to go to prison. I mean, I am I am very appreciative of what you've done, but I think that... You do the same for me. No. no. <laughs> is the immigration officer going to be asked to stay for the wedding? Right. <laughs> that is so pretty with the candles. Mm. Think she's gonna go through with it? I don't think so. Though she's gonna give her a heart attack. <laughs> well, she can't say no now because then she'll. Oh my god, he's everywhere! Right? <laughs> we are gathered here today <laughs> give thanks to give recognition to the beauty, honesty, our. Your hand is up. <laughs> it's it's uh it's not a, a question, but I, I do have something I need to say. Can it wait till after? I don't want to go to prison. <laughs> I uh I have a bit of an uh, announcement to make about the the wedding. Uh, I am a Canadian with an expired visa who was about to be deported. Oh, yours. Crap. I forced Andrew here to marry me. I'm gonna go to prison. <laughs> And I knew that if I threatened to destroy his career, he would he would do just about anything. So I blackmailed him to come up here and to lie to you. Turns out it's not easy to ruin someone's life once you find out how wonderful they are. So, what now? Once we land in New York, you have 24 hours to head back to Canada. So he's not gonna... Guy's not gonna go to prison or anything like that. Guess not. Stop I'm it! not gonna let you do this. Stop I mean it. it! I'm not asking your Joe! Joe! Hanny! Joe! Easy, Somebody easy. get a doctor! Easy, easy. I thought the guy, the stripper guy was gonna show up. <laughs> <laughs> Here I am! <laughs> okay, so the grandmother's faking this so that they can get on the plane and she's gonna say, land there. No. I bet. Watch. She's faking it just to get him up in the air. She knew that was the fastest way to get there, I bet. It's Betty White. Come on. Andrew. You two need to stop fighting. Andrew, promise me you'll work harder to be a part of this family. I will. The spirits can take me. <laughs> <laughs> She's not going to die. <laughs> They're not going to kill off Betty White. Come on. I guess they're not ready for me. <laughs> <laughs> no need to take us to the hospital. Take us to the airport, please. Told you. Larry Ferris, don't make me call your mother. Got it. <laughs> I'm like Elliot Ness. Always get my man. Elliot Ness, the Untouchables. <laughs> Dower, talk to me. Okay, I have a little favor I need from you, buddy. Uh, Margaret's on that plane. I gotta talk to her. Can you stop it? I heard about your lady, Baylor. Okay, come on. All right. Oh no! No! 
If she didn't love him, she wouldn't have lied. Of course not. Am I the only one not getting it? Oh, Joe. <laughs> Honey, it's going to be okay. Now what? They go back to... Well, she to... has 24 hours to get out of the country. So, so. he's going to go back to New York? Yeah. She dressed up to come in and pack her office? Apparently so. Got to maintain an image, I guess. I guess. Jordan! I need you to send the boxes in my office to, to this address, please. This tape? Yes. What? What? Hey. Why, why are you panting? Because I've been running. <laughs> really, from Alaska? <laughs> Today, I want to make sure everything is... Safe. Margaret, Margaret, stop talking! <laughs> <laughs> I used to dream about you getting hit by a cab or poisoned. <laughs> Things changed when we kissed and when you told me about your tattoo. Even when you checked me out when we were naked. <laughs> <laughs> it's the guy. <laughs> but I didn't realize any of this until I was standing alone. You can imagine my disappointment. <laughs> When it suddenly dawned on me that the woman I love is about to be kicked out of the country. So, Margaret, marry me. Because I'd like to date you. <laughs> I think it would just be a lot easier if we forgot everything that happened and I just left. That would be easier. I'm scared. <laughs> me too. <laughs> yeah, so who's the boss, Andrew? <laughs> <laughs> so, let me see if I got this wrong. Oh, God. <laughs> You're sure you want to go through with this? Because one wrong answer, I'm going to take you down. She's wearing the necklace. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's do it. Hit it! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> when did you first start to date? Last week. Is that going well? So far, it's great. Thank you. Was it love at first sight? No. In my mind, I see her with someone perhaps uh, more swarthy, darker. Margaret. Ah! Margaret. Ah! I've never <laughs> farted in front of him, nor will I ever fart in front of him. She farts in her sleep. <laughs> <laughs> What's her favorite color when she's not at home? Okay, that was The Proposal. What did you think? That was a fun movie. You enjoyed that? Yeah. Yeah, that was fun. I had I, I enjoyed that one. I think I liked it a lot more than uh, While You Were Sleeping. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I think it was funnier. and I don't know. It had, you could almost see like, a, okay, maybe with all the time they had spent together. Yeah. Okay. Maybe something would happen. Okay. So, at, at, towards the end there, though, I was kind of thinking he was going to end up with the other girl mm -hmm. in Alaska. And I called it, but he might fake the heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. so, do you have a favorite part or anything like that? No, or? I enjoyed all of it. I wish I it wouldn't have made me sad, but I don't think... It, I, yeah. I, yeah, you cried a couple times, but happy tears, right? Nothing too sad? I don't think they were happy tears. I think the situation was sad. Mm hmm But. Well, it had a happy ending. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they didn't get married, though, but at least she stayed in the country. Well, I got the impression they were getting married, but. Well, they, yeah, but they we didn't also, get to see that. They were also going to have their. Uh... Oh, you wanted to see the actual wedding. Yeah. Oh, okay. I kind of expected, like, they were going to, you know, fade to black and then, you know one year later or something oh. and you know she was gonna like come back from canada and they were gonna do it legal you know they weren't gonna try and do the lie it was huh. a great movie i really enjoyed it i think it was fun it was a nice change of pace good first uh tony's pick of the month for sure all right anything else you want to say no all right well if you guys enjoyed this reaction please give us a thumbs up comment down below let us know what you thought of the proposal 
Um, if you would like to see the full length reaction to this and everything else we've reacted to, we will put the link to our Patreon down below. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. It really helps us out, helps the channel grow. We really appreciate it. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye.